Over the years, Tyler the Creator has always stood out for his unique voice, creative flows, and impressive production. But just how well do his fans know his music? We decided to hit Tyler's sold out show at Madison Square Garden to find out. How big of a fan of Tyler the Creator are you? Uh, the biggest? Since eight years old. Out of ten, like a seven, eight, solid. It's all 8.5. Flower Boy helped me get through senior year of high school, so I would That's like to dedicate my life to Tyler. Thank you. What's your favorite Tyler song? Pigs. Could you give me a bar or two? Probably shouldn't. It's you probably bad. shouldn't. It's kind of a rough song, honestly. Grab a couple friends, start a couple riots, cross a couple people. The first memory I have of Tyler is probably like hearing Yonkers for the first time and thinking it was like super whack, if I'm being honest. Yonkers was the first song, and then I went all the way back to Bastard, and I've been listening ever since. When Yonkers came out with him eating the roach, I was like, I don't know about that. I saw the video eating the cockroach, I was like, yeah, this dude's dope. How well do you think you're going to do in this quiz? I'm pretty confident, but I'm a little nervous. We're going we're, we're gonna to get dragged. <laughs> I can see it already. He's gonna do better than me. <laughs> like I'm gonna, I'm gonna get so roasted for this, but like it's okay. So starting with number one, what song is all about Tyler's bicycle? Slater or parking lot? Slater. 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 I don't know that. Bitches on my handlebars. Hair blowing in the wind. Where did Tyler ask to meet on the Frank Ocean assisted track? She was it the lake or the park? The lake, I guess. It's a lake. The lake. Is that the lake around 10? Yeah. Okay, he got the lyric yeah. too. He got the lyric too. By the lake around 10, it's getting different and then we can begin the pretend game. I want to be fame from adventure and time. Which song did Tyler the Creator make for Kanye West? Is it I Ain't Got Time or Jamba? Oh, I Ain't Got, I ain't got Time. Yeah, I, I Ain't Got Time, I think. Jamba. Jamba, yeah. I'm going to go with Jamba. Right? <laughs> No, it is I ain't got time. It's I ain't got time. He didn't know Kanye like that. It was I ain't got time. In 10 seconds or less, how many Odd Future members you guys can name? Oh, oh my god. Um. Tyler, the creator, Earl Sweatshirt, Damo Genesis, Mike G. Tyler, the creator, Earl Sweatshirt, Frank Ocean, The Internet, um, Domo Genesis, Casey Veggies, Taco. Well, damn. Okay, Tyler, Frank, Tyler. Sid, uh, fucking. Haji Beats. Taco, Jasper, Sid, Frank Ocean. Uh, Earl, ta Taco, right? The Haji Beats, Left Brain, Sid the Kid, uh, Tyler, uh, Earl Swisher, and um, uh, why can I remember my man name? Did I say uh, Domo, Domo Genesis? That was good. Tyler and ASAP, that's that wing sap. Mm -hmm. What's their first collaboration? Was it What the Fuck Right Now or Smuckers? I think it's What the Fuck Right yeah, Now, I think. I'm not right sure now. though. I'm going with that, What the Fuck Right Now. What the fuck right now? Ooh, um, what the fuck right now? <laughs> it wasn't on Smokers, it was it Kanye was and Lil Wayne. I had to think about, I'm like, wait a minute, he wasn't on that track. Which Igor track features vocals from Solange? Is it Are We Still Friends or I Think? Yo, shout out to Solange and Beyonce. Yeah. I'm um, be honest, I don't know. I think. I know it's I, I know it's I think. Are We Still Friends? Are We Still Friends? Oh. It's I Think. But like, it's okay. Which track on Igor does Tyler actually say Igor? Was it What's Good or New Magic Wand? New Magic Wand. No. What's, what's good? good? I'm feeling really confident in that. When you see the brand new leak floors on leak floor, if the cop says my name, bitch, I'm Igor. So in 10 seconds, name as many of the collaborators on Igor as you can. Lil, Playboy Cardi. Lil Uzi. Kanye West. Uh, Charlie Wilson. Solange. Mm. No. Jaden Smith. <laughs> Slow tie. Solange. Kanye. Kid Cudi. Playboy Cardi. Yeah. Um, is that it? I mean, not Kid Cudi. Uh, Playboy Cardi. Uh, Charlie Wilson. We already named him. Okay. Playboy uh, Cardi. Saloon. Uzi. Uzi Playboy Cardi. Cardi. Uh, Kanye. Kanye. Uh, um, Frank Ocean wasn't on it. Frank, I don't think he was on it. Rocky uh, wasn't on it. Definitely think what sets him apart is his authenticity. Like from the jump, he's always been himself. A lot of people didn't like. Uh, Eagle when it first came out, but after a couple listens to it, it gets really like stuck deep within you. Literally everything, like from instrumentals to like fashion and stuff he does, I think it's just like I think game he's influencing changing. like literally everything. He inspired me, put me on to Supreme, and that changed my life. As I got older, I was like, alright, he's different, and like he's not afraid to show he's different. Right. But I think really it's just being the advocate for being who you are and like not caring and doing what you want. It's definitely outside the box. It, it goes so far when it comes to music, fashion. I mean, I'm, I look forward to see what he's doing with the future. Well, Tyler fans talked a big game and they definitely backed it up. How did you do? Let us know in the comments. 
I'm Delisa with Genius News, bringing you the meaning and the knowledge behind the music. Girl, you perfect, but you're too fucking young. Hey. And when temptation calls, I never pick up. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, <laughs> all right. Okay, let me not even get mad. <laughs>